Hi guys, and welcome back to Leslie Through the Looking Glass. For those of you that are new here, hi, my name is Leslie. I'm so happy to have you. For my returning viewers, as always, thank you so much for coming back to your continued support. It really means the world to me. Um, I just wanted to pop on. I honestly didn't really feel like filming today. I almost didn't film. Um, because quite honestly, I just didn't feel like it. I feel really blah today. Um, but because that's how I'm feeling, that's why I decided I should film today. Um, I am just having a moment where I am super struggling. Um, nothing's wrong. <laughs> it's really kind of frustrating. Um, I'm just, everything today is extra like difficult. Um, I'm on the verge of crying all day today. <laughs> like I just catch myself feeling like I want to cry for no reason and not cause like, not because I'm frustrated or anything like, like I'm doing dishes and I just want to cry. I feel very overwhelmed. I'm just kind of like drowning a little bit, um, with all of my feelings. So that's where I'm at. <laughs> I don't know why. Um, and I think that's the frustrating part for me. Um, I'm pretty like aware of things that trigger my anxiety and stuff like that to a large degree, obviously not perfect. And even if I know what's triggering me, I'm not always effective at stopping it by any means, but usually at least know like why I have this feeling <laughs> and I have no idea what's going on today. Um, nothing is really like out of the ordinary. Our routine has been fine. Like nothing, we had a really great weekend. Nothing really like stressful or weird happened this weekend. I have no idea. I don't know what's going on. Um, I will say the only thing I could think of um, is that I haven't been super great about self-care. Um, I've really been slacking on taking any of that like little space for myself the last you know month or so. Um, I've been trying to run on lunch breaks and stuff, which has been great. Um, but I'm just, and here's the other thing that I'm struggling with, with self care. I don't take advantage of the time that I could because I don't know what I want to be doing. That would be helpful to my psyche. <laughs> like, I, I just feel like I, it's hot. So I haven't wanted to take a bath, which is like my number one favorite way to relax is like a drink in the bathtub and just like mindless Netflix or games on my phone or whatever. And it's been hot, so I haven't really wanted to like relax in the bathtub. Um, running is great, but on the weekends, like we're doing family stuff and not that's an excuse because I can still make time for it. I just haven't, but like my desire to spend time with my child and my husband is greater than my desire to go out for a run by myself. Like that doesn't, it's not ranking high on my self care list on the weekends of things I want to do to help myself. Um, you know, I just, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Um, so I don't know if that's part of why I'm feeling lost. Um, because I'm just kind of like, not forcing myself to do something that maybe will be self care. So basically I just am curious, does anybody ever else feel that way? Like, you know, you need to take care of yourself and like you prioritize self care in theory, but are there like phases you go through where like you just, none of those things really bring you joy that you want to go do it. Or is that just my anxiety slash like borderline depression, self, just not making a priority. So I'm talking myself into the fact that it won't help me. I don't know. Um, I did schedule a therapy session for next week. Um, after the miscarriage, I had a few sessions, um, and got things kind of under control there. Um, and then like, we've talked about spacing it out until I feel like I get to a point where I really need to talk. Um, and I'm just kind of at that point right now, not because I'm feeling like I'm struggling that much with my anxiety. Like I still feel like most times I have a pretty good grip on it. 
Um, it's not hindering my ability to like want to live my life and do all the things. Um, it's there, but it's controlled to the most part, I feel like. Um, but then this is going on and I'm feeling this sort of way and I'm just wondering if that's why I'm feeling this way. <laughs> I don't know. So I am gonna, I do have that next week, um, next Monday, but I just, I don't know. So I'm just wondering, have, do you ever experience this? And if you do, do you feel like it's because you're just letting the anxiety or whatever take over? Or is it because truly you're just kind of like floating and you don't really, you're just in a funk where those things don't really help. Um, and like I said, like, I don't feel like on the weekends I need it. I feel like things are great. And then like come Monday, I just like get this like mental struggle fatigue. I don't know. But I just felt like I would come on and talk about it with you guys and kind of like share that side of it. Um, because I'm always one to promote self-care and talk about what I do. But I'm kind of in a rut right now. Um, I do have a float and massage gift card that I'm really going to try to find a Sunday soon to book that. Um, that I got for Valentine's Day. <laughs> that I haven't used yet. Um, and that was really relaxing when I did the float last time. So um, I want to get that on the books and give myself that opportunity. And I guess maybe if I schedule that, maybe that'll give me some insight on to whether or not it's just like a mental thing or if I just am kind of like, just, I don't know, <laughs> not sure what to do to take care of myself in a positive way right now. Um, but yeah. Like I said, though, like nothing's bad. I'm not in that, like, I'm not struggling, like, for the most part with my anxiety. I'm not, like, things are good at home. I feel like, you know, I'm still taking Amelia to do things even if they make me nervous. Like, um, my husband and I are going and doing things with our her and they're fun. Um, but yeah, I'm just kind of in a funk today, guys. I don't know. <laughs> I hope that makes sense to somebody. Let me know in the comments down below. Do you relate to this? Like, do you want to take care of yourself but just not know what to do sometimes? Because that's where I feel like I'm at right now. And it's very unusual to me because, like, I could always find things to go do before. And now I'm just like, I don't know. And I don't know if it's COVID things and maybe that's, like, COVID is worse again. But I'm not, like, afraid of it. I'm vaccinated. I, if I'm uncomfortable, I wear a mask. Like, I don't. But like I'm not going, I used to go to the movies on like a Sunday afternoon by myself for a couple hours and watch a movie. But like that just doesn't sound that relaxing to me right now. I don't know if it's just because there's nothing I'm really excited to see or if it's because I, I don't know. Or I, who knows. Or maybe I'm having more mom guilt than I realized because I was just going to say there's nothing that I feel like is, I guess that's what it is. It's not so much mom guilt it is it is I don't. I don't feel guilty going to do something that I really want to do. I feel guilty going to do something that is just like, mm, I could go do this just to take some time to myself, but I don't really care that much about it. So I don't want to give up that time. It's like finding the balance of what, what is important enough that I want to sacrifice that time while taking care of myself versus what is just like a cop out. I don't know. But yeah. So that's where we're at this week, guys. Like I said, everything really is going pretty well um, as far as like all of the anxiety stuff. I am just a bit of funk today. I, and I assume it'll pass uh, pretty quickly. I used to feel this way quite a lot, um, but I haven't felt this way in a long time. So maybe that's also what's throwing me off is like I just haven't felt this way in a while. But there's highs and lows and you know, there's always going to be these little step backs and that's just where we're at today. <laughs> All right, guys, if you aren't already, please consider hitting subscribe down below. If you hit the bell notifications next to it, you'll be alerted every time I post new content. 
um, coming up on this channel. My next Disney video will be Saturday. Um, Kelly and Brayden over at Magical Disney Pals tagged me in an ear tag. And it's my first ever tag, so I'm really excited. Um, so that's going to be this weekend. Um, and then I'll be back Mental Health Monday. And then the week after that, my Disney video will actually be a couple days late because I am going to swap the post on the 30th. So look forward to that. Um, but yeah, guys, that's all I have today. Like I said, let me know in the comments below. Do you ever feel this way? Do you know why you feel that way? Let me know. <laughs> Otherwise, I hope you guys have a great week. Let's go into it with a big, strong, positive attitude, and I'll see you this weekend. Bye, guys.